I woke up literally with the guys dragging me out of this fancy restaurant by my heels. I went and Britain's Got Talent when I was younger, and it's true. I know it's bad. It's so bad, isn't it? I've never seen any of the Rocky films. I need to watch them. Only I would knock myself out of a car boot. We went three rounds and I knocked him out in the second. Boy. Beautiful. Shit then. Day 4,000 in lockdown. And day 4,000 of Louis needing a haircut. Gonna go ballistic. Need to get to my barber's ASAP. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll know what this video is about. Because you'd have got involved. I hope you would have got involved anyway. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, go follow. Yes, I've dropped below 10k, I know. But that's my own fault. Because when was the last time Louis posted a photo? <sighs> April last year. What do I expect? If you follow me and you got involved, you'll know what this is about. How well does my Instagram know me? We're about to find out. 40 questions. Four. Zero. Have been asked to you guys. And you've all responded. I'm going to see how well you've done. Guys, welcome back to LSC TV. If you are new here my name is louis chastel make sure to smash that subscribe button hit the like button and let's get into this video now i asked 40 questions some easy some not well i guess unless you know me as a person some of them ain't that easy but you can throw some guesses out there we're gonna go through them and we're gonna see what you guys thought so we're starting off at number one how old am i now your options were 20 22 24 or 26 and to be fair the majority of you got it right i'm 22 years old next question now this stuff i don't really follow to be honest, I know a lot of people that do follow it, but I asked you guys to guess what my star sign is. You had the choice of Aries, Pisces, Libra, or Scorpio, and you got it wrong. You got it wrong. Most people put Pisces or Libra. Guys, I'm an Aries. 25th of March, that's Aries. I've heard Aries are proper funny, which is makes sense because I'm I'm jokes. So <laughs> true or false? I've never seen any of the Rocky films. And 52% of you put false i'm sorry you're wrong if you click true you're right i know it's bad it's so bad isn't it i've never seen any of the rocky films i need to watch them i need to watch them because i know i will like them so yeah that is on my uh things to do right now this is a trick question only seven of you put the right answer how long have i been doing youtube for and the correct answer is 10 years now hear me out i haven't been doing it consistently for 10 years but back in the day man was a skateboarder and i had a skateboard channel and this is what you had to deal with with the editing and all that listen i was about yeah i've been doing it 10 years which only seven you guessed realistically i've been doing it three years but if you want to count everything i've been doing it 10 years next question true or false when i was 12 i knocked myself out of a car boot most of you put true and that is correct listen listen so i was packing up stuff in the car for my mum and um, as I closed the boot, for whatever reason, as I closed it down, I was standing too near it and it hit me, like smacked me straight on the head there. And I was fine at first, like it hit me proper hard and I was fine. And I went inside and I was bleeding across the head. Mum got me a plaster and that. And yeah, after that, I started to feel a bit sick. I was like, what's going on? Bang. Next thing you know, I'm walking towards the car and I wake up on the floor. So yeah, only I would knock myself out of a car boot. Next question. Have I ever been to America? 49% of you put yes. 51% of you put no. So the majority of you are right. No, I've not been to America. Definitely going to be happening in the near future once all this COVID's over, you know. Definitely want to be going to America. Next question. Where is my mum's side of the family from? Now, the options were France, Portugal, Italy, and Brazil. Most of you got it right. So you're obviously all real ones. Yes, my family's from Italy. I'm Italian, part Italian. Big up the pasta and all that. But yeah, no, we are we're part Italian. Mum's side's all from Italy. Uh, my mum's mum was full Italian. So yeah. Next question. My boy, Sonny. What is my... Oh, I've just gave away the answer. <laughs> what is my dog's name? Sonny, Reggie, Tony, or Daniel? Obviously, it's Sonny. Majority of you put Sonny, so clearly you know me well. Listen, if you're calling your dog Daniel, yeah? Issues. you got issues. Daniel ain't no dog name. Right, next question. If you know me well, you will know the answer to this one. And if you don't, you're just guessing. My favourite type of holiday. Hot holiday, city break, ski holiday, or spa holiday. Majority of you got it right. Ski holiday. Listen, if you ain't checked my ski video, go look at that now. But yeah, I've been skiing twice, and I'll do it over any holiday. I... I promise it's the best. I love adrenaline, all that stuff. So yeah, ski holiday's the one for me. True or false, I was born in Brazil. Most of you put the right answer. I wasn't born in Brazil, no. But for the ones that did, yeah, I see you. Oh, guess who put it? My best mate, Howard, once again. I weren't born in Brazil. Howard knows that. And Cam as well. Listen, these guys know they're trying to they're trying to manipulate the system. Next question: How tall am I? You got five foot ten, six foot, six foot two, and six foot four. Majority, you got it right. I'm six foot two. Who put five foot ten? People are trying to ruin this for me. But yeah, I'm six foot two. Next one. Next question: True or false? Now see, look, most of you got this wrong. This shows that you don't know me. True or false? I went on Britain's Got Talent when I was younger, and it's true. When I was younger, I think I was maybe eleven. I went on Britain's Got Talent. I didn't get through to the live shows, and I didn't get through to the auditions but i went for the day to audition for britain's got talent and i sung riding solo by jason derulo didn't get put on tv and i didn't get through so yeah i guess that's a big l in my life and i don't think i fully recovered from it 
Next question, true or false? In 2018, I passed out in a fancy restaurant. Majority, you got this right. This is true, guys. This actually happened. And I'm gonna tell you the story. Nice restaurant, yeah? They're doing nice food. They got live music, all that. I'm sitting now, finished my meal, decided to have a little coffee. For some reason, I must have had too many beers. I banged five sugars in my coffee. Don't know why I did it, but I did it. Like, you know, I'm gonna stick with my decision. Drinking it is hella sweet. Like, this coffee is so sweet. So obviously, because I've just had loads of beers and now I'm drinking coffee with loads of sugar in it, I feel a bit sick. Like, I felt sick. And I thought to myself, right, I cannot cause a scene in this restaurant. Like, this is a fancy restaurant. I've got to be careful what I do here. So I'm stressing myself out. I'm like, I can't be sick. Like, I've got to be fine. So about 10 minutes later, it's time to leave. I get up. You think I remember what happened? I woke up literally with the guys dragging me out of this fancy restaurant by my heels. I passed out, man. Went to the doctor after. They just said that I had a uh, panic attack or something like that or high blood sugar. I don't know what it was, but yeah, that did happen. Uh, weren't one of the greatest moments of my life. Shout out to the waiters and staff and all that they were really nice unfortunately that restaurant is closed down now due to covid but yeah they did the best best calamari in the business i went there loads of times even after i passed out true or false my numbers came in on the lottery but i forgot to buy the ticket most of you got it right it's false if this was true i'd just be sitting in my room with the blinds closed under my covers for the rest of my life oh, i couldn't imagine imagine next question my middle name is it nathaniel santino rodney or alfonso majority got it right once again you know my middle name santino big up the italians true or false when i was 11 i had a fist fight with a monkey now most of you have put false and i'm gonna be honest with you you're wrong because i did we went three rounds and i knocked him out in the second didn't never happened never happened do you know what i would have given a monkey a good fight though when i was 11 bro i had big boy muscles next question true or false i've never been arrested now i'm quite surprised this is quite mixed we've got 47 percent for false and 53 percent for true yeah if you vote true you're right because i'm good or maybe it's because i never get caught Next question. If you listen, I can't believe how mixed this question is. I can't believe how mixed the answers are. Am I a night owl or an early bird? If you voted night owl, yeah, you do not know me in the slightest. I am not a night owl at all. Listen, I need my sleep. Before I did my job working nights, I used to be in bed every night by 10 o'clock. Like, I need my sleep and I get up early. That's what I do. Weekends, I get up early. I never really lay in. So, yeah, if you voted night owl, sort it out. Next question. Am I an introvert or an extrovert? 44% went intro and 56 went extra. I'm extra. What sport did I do on sports day in school? Now you've got long jump, high jump, 100 meters or 400 meters. Most of you got this right and you're real ones. I did high jump. I was sick at high jump. So sick at high jump. I ain't done it in years though. I ain't done it since school actually. True or false, I'm allergic to chocolate. Some people put true. I'm clearly not allergic to chocolate. What a life. Right, this question is quite a hard one. I wouldn't expect a lot of people to know it unless you really, really know me like you're my. Unless you are like a really good friend, you're not going to know this. So this would be a guess pretty much. What is my favorite movie? Options were The Wolf of Wall Street, The Warriors, The Green Mile or Step Brothers. Step Brothers. Step Brothers is the best film that was ever made. And if you disagree, you can click off this video right now. Please don't ever say Step Brothers ain't the best film ever made. But y'all don't say that. Next question. This is, I guess this is just a guess for most people. How many lessons did it take for me to pass my driving test? Now, the majority of you got the right answer. It took me 15 lessons. I passed it pretty quick. I literally turned 17, did my first lesson on my birthday and passed within like two months. I, I did it so quick. Next question. True or false? I nearly drowned at sea on holiday in 2014. This is true. This is another story time. I'm on holiday. Just been for lunch. I've just had a full belly of food. And me and my cousin decide we're going to swim out to the little boys. You know the boys at the back which, where you can't go past? Yeah, we swam out to them. I get there, get cramped, the night. Get cramped in my stomach because I've just eaten. Most scared I've ever been in my life. I thought this was it. I'm literally hanging on to this boy for my dear life. My dear life. The cramp did pass after about 30 minutes, but yeah, I was out there hanging on to it and I thought I was going to drown. I literally had to swim back so slow. Nearly had to get the lifeguards out. So yeah, that was a pretty scary experience, but... I'm here now to tell the story. Next question. What was my first pet? Dog, mouse, fish, or stick insect? If you are a real OG, my first pet was a stick insect. I got them at a uh, church fair when I was like eight. And I used to keep them in tanks and sit with them on my shoulder and everything. My, if my mum was watching this, she'll laugh at that because I used to, used to sit with these stick insects on my shoulder. So yeah, that was my first pet, stick insect. Next question. What is my favorite TV series? The Walking Dead, Breaking Bad, Power, or Peaky Blinders? It's Breaking Bad. And I'm going to tell you something that might hurt a lot of opinions. I don't rate Power. I really don't rate Power. I've seen Breaking bad five times five times that's a good series if you can watch it five times power i got halfway through it and i stopped don't rate it. i might continue it but breaking bad is the one walking dead is very good as well next question what country do i want to live in when i'm older america spain stay in england or move to thailand now the answer is america and i'm gonna tell you why I, I don't know i feel like there's so much more going on in america so much more fun stuff to do probably only move there for a couple years just to live there for a bit but i wouldn't stay there forever but yeah i definitely would like to live in america for a bit when i'm older and most of you got that right so congratulations next question what is my biggest 
fear height the sea small spaces or the dark now if i'm honest i don't really have big fears like that with stuff but if i was going to pick one of them it's the sea the thing that scares me about the sea is you don't know what's beneath you if you're on a boat or you go on a jet ski and you fall off the jet ski you don't know what's beneath you we've discovered five percent of the sea and you're trying to tell me you know what's beneath me no way you don't you're a liar next question what food do i refuse to eat olives garlic bread sweet potato or mushrooms so most of you voted mushrooms and if you voted mushrooms yeah you're a donut mushrooms are Pangs. Olives. Dirty olives. Ugh. No way. Next question. What sport do I play? Football, cricket, golf, or tennis? Clearly, you all know me because most of you got it right. I play golf. Tiger Woods in the making. Next question. What console do I play? Xbox or PlayStation? And most of you got it wrong. I play PlayStation. I used to play Xbox, but ever since Spider Man came out, I knew it was time to change. I went straight to PlayStation. I've never looked back. What was my favourite childhood show? Sweet Life on Deck, SpongeBob, iCarly, or Drake and Josh? Most of you went for Sweet Life on Deck or SpongeBob, and you are all wrong. Drake and Josh is the way. Apparently, they took down the Drake and Josh house, which is sad. But yeah, he's what it is. Now, am I left-handed or right-handed? 53% of you put right, 47% put left. If you put right-handed, congratulations, I'm a right-handed guy. What weird food combo do I love? Ice cream and soy sauce, Nutella and ready sorted crisps, cereal and ketchup, or Skittles on toast? If any of you voted for anything other than Nutella and ready sorted crisps, go see a doctor. If you ain't tried Nutella and ready sorted crisps, yeah, it's a vibe. Check it out. Favorite food: sausage and mash, spag bowl, pizza, or salmon. So if you got the question right from earlier, you know. It's going to be spag bowl when i tell you my mum makes the best spag bowl you will ever have i invite every single one of my subscribers to come around to my house and try my mum's spag bowl and you try to tell me they ain't boy beautiful if i had one last meal in the world i have my mum's spag bowl so peng so peng what football team do i support arsenal west ham chelsea or liverpool So yeah, I support Chelsea. Next question, true or false? I've never broke a bone in my body. If you put false, you got it wrong. Most of you put false as well. I've actually, oh crap. I've actually never broke a bone in my body. I broke my little toe, but I don't think that counts. So yeah, such would that don't happen anytime soon. Now this one, this question, you have to know me very well to get this right. Only one of these is true. I've fallen into the River Thames. I have my pilot license. I've never seen a Marvel movie. No matter where I go, I always have a pack of mints on me. And most of you got it right. No matter where I go. I have a pack of mints on me. Now, I change mints from time to time. Sometimes I have strong mints, sometimes I have soft mints. Sometimes I have polos. Anywhere I go, I have a pack of mints on me. And you know what? Most of the time, I don't even eat them, but I just have them with me. I don't know why. I can't leave the house having a pack of mints on me. Weird stuff, I know, but it is what it is. But congratulations, most of you did get that right. Let me tell you what, I've really enjoyed making this video. If you want to see another video like this on my channel, maybe where we do it with a live chat, I don't know, something else, make sure to smash that like button and comment below. Let me know what you want to see next. Guys, I'm so glad I'm back to making content. I ain't stopping now, I promise you that. The next video i make is going to be so good i can't wait for you guys to see it if you've enjoyed this smash the like button hit the subscribe button thank you for watching lsc tv i'll see you real soon i got jeans to it ferraris i got jeans to it for cars i've been dabbing in versace who know you know who we are we get we get